In this video, we will discuss what alcohol does to your body and its various effects that everyone should be aware of. Drinking alcohol is so common that people may not question how even one beer, cocktail, or glass of wine could impact their health. Alcohol is a part of cultural traditions all around the world, and it's also a drug that chemically alters the body. People of all ages need to understand these effects. So, what does alcohol do to your body? Number one, your brain shrinks. If you drink heavily for a long time, alcohol can affect how your brain looks and works. Its cells start to change and even get smaller. Too much alcohol can actually shrink your brain. And that'll have big effects on your ability to think, learn, and remember things. It can also make it harder to keep a steady body temperature and control your movements. Heavy drinking means eight or more drinks a week for women and 15 or more for men. Number two, does it help you sleep? Alcohol's slowdown effect on your brain can make you drowsy, so you may doze off more easily, but you won't sleep well. Your body processes alcohol throughout the night. Once the effects wear off, it leaves you tossing and turning. You don't get that good REM sleep your body needs to feel restored, and you're more likely to have nightmares and vivid dreams. You'll also probably wake up more often for trips to the bathroom. Number three, more stomach acid. Alcohol irritates the lining of your stomach and makes your digestive juices flow. If enough acid and alcohol build up, you get nauseated and you may throw up. Years of heavy drinking can cause painful sores called ulcers. It can also lead to irritation of the lining of the stomach, called gastritis. Number four, diarrhea and heartburn. Our small intestine and colon get irritated too. Alcohol throws off the normal speed that food moves through them. That's why hard drinking can lead to diarrhea, which can turn into a long-term problem. It also makes heartburn more likely because it relaxes the muscle that keeps acid out of your esophagus, the tube that connects your mouth and stomach. Number five, why you have to pee. Again, your brain helps your body stay well hydrated by producing a hormone that keeps your kidneys from making too much urine. But when alcohol swings into action, it tells your brain to hold off on making that hormone. That means you have to go more often, which can leave you dehydrated. When you drink heavily for years, that extra workload and the toxic effects of alcohol can wear your kidneys down. Number six, the steps to liver disease. Your liver breaks down almost all the alcohol you drink. In the process, it handles a lot of toxins. Over time, heavy drinking makes the organ fatty and lets thicker, fibrous tissue build up. That limits blood flow, so liver cells don't get what they need to survive. As they die off, the liver gets scars and stops working as well a disease called cirrhosis. Number seven, pancreas damage and diabetes. Normally, this organ makes insulin and other chemicals that help your intestines break down food. But drinking too much alcohol jams that process up. The chemicals stay inside the pancreas. Along with toxins from alcohol, they can cause inflammation in the organ over time, which can lead to serious damage. After years, that means you won't be able to make the insulin you need, which can lead to diabetes. It also makes you more likely to get pancreatic cancer. Number eight, what's a hangover? That cotton-mouthed, bleary-eyed morning after is no accident. Alcohol makes you dehydrated and makes blood vessels in your body and brain expand. That gives you your headache. Your stomach wants to get rid of the toxins and acid that alcohol churns up, which gives you nausea and vomiting. And because your liver was so busy processing your drinks, it didn't release enough sugar into your blood, bringing on weakness and the shakes. Number nine, an offbeat heart. One night of binge drinking can jumble the electrical signals that keep your heart's rhythm steady. If you do it for years, you can make those heart rhythm changes permanent and cause what's called arrhythmia, and alcohol can wear your heart out. Over time, it causes heart muscles to droop and stretch, like an old rubber band. Your heart can't pump blood as well, and that impacts every part of your body. Number 10, a change in body temperature. Alcohol widens your blood vessels, making more blood flow to your skin. That makes you blush and feel warm and toasty, but not for long. The heat from that extra blood passes right out of your body, causing your temperature to drop. On the other hand, long-term heavy drinking boosts your blood pressure. It makes your body release stress hormones that narrow blood vessels, so your heart has to pump harder to push blood through. Number 11, a weaker immune system. You might not link a cold to a night of drinking, but there might be a connection. Alcohol puts the brakes on your body's defenses, 
or immune system. Your body can't make the numbers of white blood cells it needs to fight germs. So for 24 hours after drinking too much, you're more likely to get sick. Long-term heavy drinkers are much more likely to get illnesses like pneumonia and tuberculosis. Number 12, impact on hormones. These powerful chemicals manage everything from your sex drive to how fast you digest food. To keep it all going smoothly, you need them in the right balance. But drinking alcohol may have an impact. For example, some studies suggest that moderate alcohol drinking can affect fertility for some women. Research also shows that heavy drinking by men may lower testosterone levels and affect the making of sperm. Number 13, hearing loss. Alcohol impacts your hearing, but no one's sure exactly how. It could be that it messes with the part of your brain that processes sound, or it might damage the nerves and tiny hairs in your inner ear that help you hear. However it happens, drinking means you need a sound to be louder so you can hear it, and that can become permanent. Drinking heavily for a long time has been linked to hearing loss. Number 14, thin bones, less muscle. Heavy drinking can throw off your calcium levels. Along with the hormone changes that alcohol triggers, that can keep your body from building new bone. Your bones get thinner and more fragile, a condition called osteoporosis. Alcohol also limits blood flow to your muscles and gets in the way of the proteins that build them up. Over time, you'll have lower muscle mass and less strength. Number 15, dissolution in blood. Approximately 33% of the alcohol consumed is absorbed into blood through the stomach lining immediately after consumption. The remaining alcohol diffuses slowly in the blood via small intestine. Alcohol is carried to the liver through the bloodstream. The liver metabolizes a certain level of alcohol, while the rest is circulated all over the body. The blood alcohol level increases when a person consumes a higher amount of alcohol than the body can metabolize. Increase in blood alcohol level slows down the respiratory system and results in fatality or coma stage due to interruption in the oxygen supply to the brain. How long does alcohol stay in your body? The length of time alcohol stays in the body will depend on factors such as individual features, how much a person has drunk, and how fast. Some tests can detect alcohol in the body for up to 24 hours. Alcohol is a depressant that has a short lifespan in the body. Once the alcohol has entered your bloodstream, your body will metabolize a certain amount of alcohol every hour, depending on the individual and other factors like liver size and weight. In summary, the concept of a white month might be a good idea after all. That's all for today, and I hope you enjoyed it. If so, make sure to like, share, and subscribe to OptiHealth for more captivating health-related content. As always, thanks for joining us on this journey, and until next time, stay cool, stay healthy, and stay curious.